of in a close to completing a deal, we believe, for Salomon Rondon from uh, Zenit St. Petersburg. One that's come a little bit from left field, but uh, he's obviously a player that they rate highly because they're going to pay, we think, about £15 million, which would uh, smash the club transfer record, which currently stands at £10 million for Brownie Day last summer. Uh, although, we, although we don't believe that all of that £10 million has, has yet been paid, there are a lot of add-ons, and I would uh, expect there to be uh, quite a few add-ons uh, within the £15 million as well for, for Rondon, but st still a huge transfer fee. And a big player as well, uh, six foot three, uh, the kind of big striker that Tony Pulis likes, and then he hasn't really got. And it looks on the face of it like his style will complement that of uh, Sado Berahino and Ricky Lambert, who were the, the other two senior strikers at the club. Any news on, on Gnabry? Yeah, Gnabry has just been confirmed. Um, he's signed on a season-long loan from Arsenal. Um, another player that Tony Pulis has been looking for for a while. He's been looking to add pace and width to his team. Nabi though won't be uh, available for the first game of the season against Man City for two reasons. Uh, firstly, Albion missed the deadline to register him in time for the opening weekend and also he's lacking a little bit in match fitness so they'll be working on him next week.